हेलो नमस्ते सलाम वालेकुम सत्याकाल वेलकम बैक टू अनदर सेशन विथ योर वाश ऑफ एट वार एवा डॉट कॉम यू नो अरबी इन साउथ इंडिया वी मेक व नाइस खट्टा मीठा डिश यूजिंग सांबार पाउडर बॉईल दिस अरबी एंड देन कट दिस अरबी इनटू लेंथ वाइज सो दैट दे आर थिन एंड इन द पैन ऐड टू टेबल स्पून ऑफ ऑयल बिकॉज वी गोइंग टू फ्राई द अरबी फर्स्ट एंड वंस द ऑयल इज स्लाइटली हॉट then add the pieces of arbi into the oil and we're going to cook till they are slightly fried and slightly golden in color you want to just cook them till they slightly golden not too much brown or anything so this should be good enough i'm going to transfer them into another plate in the same oil add some red chili add some mustard seeds always whenever we make anything sour with uh, tamarind and specially with jaggery we add some fenugreek seeds do not add too much because that can give little bit bitterness in this urad dal wash and then add curry leaves oh, oh, oh. a little more of curry leaves and i'm going to add pinch of turmeric and chopped onion usually whenever we make some kind of uh, curry with the tamarind and uh, jaggery i also add hing but since we are adding sambar powder hing is already there so i'm skipping that hing part here we'll saute this onion a little bit add uh, Half a teaspoon of ginger garlic paste. Let this ginger garlic paste lose its raw flavor. Add salt, chili powder. Now add sambar powder. If you do not have sambar powder, you can check out my video on how to make sambar powder. If not, you can use the store bought uh, masala also. In this, add tamarind juice. I think this should be good enough. And because this is a very thick tamarind juice, I'm going to add some water to make it into nice sauce. I think I can add some more of tamarind juice and some more of water also. and uh, we're going to bring this mixture to a nice boil then i'm going to add jaggery cook it for two more minutes and then add our arbi now you can add some jaggery in this depending on your taste you can add little more or little less but jaggery is a must for this preparation after you add the jaggery just cover it with the lid and let it cook for another 10 minutes because this tamarind juice and the jaggery needs to get nicely cooked that's when the raw flavor will be gone and it will be tasty wow now this is all ready you can see that this sauce is very nice and uh, nice silky in this this arbi that is kolkashia just add in this and we going to let it cook in this on a slow flame for around 3 4 minutes and the dish will all be ready or we are waiting for this uh, arbi to suck in some nice juices from this gravy we put the lid on and wait for 2 minutes and eat it with this curry i love mudda pappu mudda pappu is the dal preparation which is cooked with tor dal we don't add anything just boil it add little bit pinch of salt and some ghee on top with that this nice katta mitta dal will be awesome switch off the flame ah oh, you know wow any south indian will die for this aroma wow look at it look at it and here you know you can make it thicker or thinner depending on your choice but this should be nice and silky sauce and then just some garnish now ah oh, this is just perfect and a piece of papad mm wow awesome sambar flavored infused into my arbi wow dear friends this is very simple yet very fantastic dish you know great variation to make with arbi but do not forget whatever is all about inspiring others to cook so please post your recipes and cooking tips so others can benefit from your great cooking thank you